Hello, my name is Darren Dennington from Service with Style Secret Shopping and Consulting. Thank you for your time today, as I felt it was very important to put together a short video for our clients and pass on some things that we're seeing in the industry regarding service and customer perception and training programs. We also wanted to highlight a few new things we're doing here at Service with Style and make sure that you're getting the most out of your program. And whether you met us at a trade show or our annual meetings, maybe you were at a presentation or a workshop, maybe we came into your restaurant or business for a staff training. You might be part of our coaching program where we work with you every month to help you get better and better. Or you might be part of our secret shopping program and have no idea who we are because you're not supposed to know us. We wanted to say thank you. For the past 22 years, we've been working with great companies all across Canada, North America, and through the Caribbean islands. And we truly appreciate the partnership that we have with you. We're very proud to now be the newest member of the Cisco National Eye Care Program. Service is changing. What is taking place in our industries right now is going to change for years and years to come. Going through a pandemic has changed people's perception. We understand that to grow a business, you have to be good at service. If you want to build your business over and over and over, you provide a great service experience, a memorable experience. And here's what takes place. Think about the, the last secret shopping report we sent you, or maybe the last restaurant that you walked into yourself, and put a score on it. Well, from being part of secret shopping for 22 years, I wanted to understand what those scores meant, right? If we got a 67% or a 92%, what was our actionable step? Would we come back more often? Would we never? So we did a great study trying to figure out what the customers or your guests did after a specific experience. Here's what we came up with. The 90% and above. Now, this is a fantastic experience. For us, that is great. You should be shooting for a 90% and above on every secret shopping report. Well, if I was dining with you or visiting you monthly, now I'm going to instantly increase my visits a little bit because you shared with me such a great experience. But here's the key to the whole thing. If you want to build your business through service, three experiences in a row at above a 90%, now say that I trust you. I trust where I'm about to spend my $65 that I know that I'm going to get value from that. And if it's three times in a row and I now trust you, I'm going to pass that good word on to a few friends. The 75 to 89%, you met my expectations. Everything was fine. I'll be back next month the month after, the month after. The 60 to 74%, this one's tricky because a lot of times owners and managers don't understand that your guests are receiving this type of experience. If I was dining with you monthly, I'm instantly going to drop that back to once every three to five months. The reason why I come back is something specific. Maybe it was a certain dish on the menu or it was a, a, a great value or the location of your business is very convenient for you. But why they do not come back is because of the people. The 50 to 59%, this one's simple. Typically, I'm not a confrontational person. So when I get my guest check, I'm just gonna sign my book, close it, and never think about you again. Because I have so many other options. Now with the below the 50%, the, the good thing is here that it only happens out of just over 400,000 reports in the system, it only happens uh, just over 1% of the time. But when it does, it's damaging. The part of this is that you gave me content. You, you gave your customer a, a story, something to talk about. It was that bad that we want to pass it on. And the old adage is, is that 9 out of 10 unhappy customers do not complain to management. However, we tell an average of nine friends about our crappy experience because you gave me the story. So we wanna limit those the, the best that you can. You wanna push all your customers to the 90% and realize that the, the 60 to 74% is your opportunity. Because typically when we get an experience that was really mediocre with a few problems and we start to choose a, another business, usually your staff and your management don't understand that. So that's the area of opportunity that you really have to work on. But what you ultimately have to realize is that the people that don't come back typically come back don't come back because of an attitude of indifference right 68% of the people that say they will never walk into your business again 
do so because they received an attitude of indifference from one of your employees. This is what a secret shopping program is designed to help. We always found that if we had detailed reports by quality shoppers, those details help you get better and better. We are uh, professionally observed uh, observers with a, a great program, the reports are detailed. All of the reporting is private. That means it goes directly to you and isn't published anywhere else. We've got a fantastic online software program called Shop Metrics. I'll show you that in a moment. And it's, it's all web driven for your, your scores. The service program that I like to see, and here's the tricky piece, is that a lot of places assume that they have good service because you have friendly staff and and you've got some good employee morale, you just assume that that's always carried through to your guests. Well, that's where the secret shopping report comes in. We're there to keep everybody on their toes. They may not know when we come in, but they know that we're coming in once a month and they have a heightened sense of awareness. My favorite part of a, a service plan is to take a secret shopping report and plop it down on the table in the middle of a manager's meeting. Every single month, let's review the secret shopping report. And when you talk about it with your managers, service starts to become part of the topic. And you identify a few great things that that particular person did. And you'll highlight some things that maybe your staff isn't fully aware of all your policies and procedures. And unfortunately, we're probably going to highlight a few things that you never want to see take place again. And you can make sure that your staff is doing that. When you incorporate your staff and you train them on your expectations, and what is in the secret shopping report, they feel good about it. And when you come back and you know, pat them on the back for doing a great job, it really helps employee morale, which can lower your turnover. For the past while, we've been dealing with the pandemic, and this has changed the customer perception drastically. We've added a brand new section to all of our secret shopping reports called current climate. This current climate section is now going to have observations on social distancing and gloves and masks and cleanliness procedures and was there sanitizer available to the guests? These are critical details that you have to know. What we're finding is that a lot of companies are putting in some really good policies and procedures, but your staff isn't following through with those. So we want to follow up with a secret shopping program to help you do that. Over the years, we've been asked several times, how do you find your shoppers and, and what makes them so good? Well, we've taken this part of secret shopping to a whole new level. We've always felt that if we wanted detailed reports so that you, the owner and the manager, can really make an impact in your business, they had to be done by quality shoppers. We put a lot of time and effort into recruiting the right people and, and hiring the right ones, and training and communicating with them and, and testing them. We've got numerous shoppers all across the country and we're ready and prepared to, to come into your business and with, with a good eye. Now, over the past few months, like every business, we've been trying to get better and better. We're very proud to roll out Surveys Plus. This is a whole new way to collect information in your business, from digital comment cards to customer questionnaires and employee questionnaires, employee evaluations, business inspections, all kinds of great ways this can be added to your secret shopping program. And there's tons of details on that on servicewithstyle.com. Now, Shop Metrics is our online software program that stores all your secret shopping reports, all your customer questionnaires, your digital comment cards, everything in one place. It's got all these great graphs and charts and uh, several different features for you. So I'm just gonna change screens here quickly and, and share with you a little bit of shop metrics. So when you start off, you go to sws.shopmetrics.com. You'll log in. And once you log in, this is now your profile. And the home page is, is just simple. The, the last 20 reports will, will come up on the right hand side and it'll give you a, a couple of graphs and, and charts. Well, what you really want to look at is the six tabs across the top. We're on your home page. When you go into Survey Explorer, this is how you search for all of your surveys. The most recent ones would come to the top and you simply click on that and opens up your survey, which is very detailed and number one shows you the score. It breaks down into sections of different scores that you received and shows you how you did last visit compared to this. And then we get into the, to the heart of the report. This particular one was on a breakfast observation and we're looking at the, the seater, the greeter, everything to do with service and 
quality of food and beverage and, and the promptness and uh, cleanliness and what the manager was doing. You know the reports. They're, they're very detailed. And at the bottom is all your, your pictures and um, receipts. So on the top, uh, Media Explorer is, is basically where this holds all of your pictures or receipts or any attachments that we had to the report. It takes an extra second to load with all the pictures, but uh, that's where you can see in, in one place all the additional attachments. Uh, custom rollups, this is where we ask you to take just a few minutes and it's different ways that you can pull different information. So if you had 10 or 15 reports and you just wanted to figure out which report Cindy was in, you can easily do that. The report portal is numerous different pre-populated reports that you can see all your scores compiled in one area. I like to spend a, a couple minutes and kind of pick out my, my few favorite then every time that's where I go back. And the, uh, the scoring you know, just breaks into PDFs or an Excel, so you can very quickly export all of the information. Now, when you're at the, the client dashboard, this is just a, a collage of different reports that you can pick and choose from to, to build a, a dashboard of how you like to see it. So there's all kinds of great features on shop metrics, and we, we hope that you'll take a, a few minutes if you don't have your login, you can easily reach out to us at, at any time and we'll, we'll help you get, get through all that. The programs that we have are a, a few different levels. So uh, most of you are in our secret shopping program where you get our secret shopping report. Our professional membership piece is your secret shopping plus everything in shop metrics. And now we've got a brand new premium level, which is your secret shopping with shop metrics and surveys plus. So it gives you all the extra details. If you wanted to add on surveys plus, uh, just to give you an example, it would just be $29 a month to add on all of the additional benefits to a secret shopping program for surveys plus. You can get some great details at servicewithstyle.com. Now, what we would love to do is schedule a quick phone call with you to review your program. Maybe you like some questions changed on the reports. Maybe you like some different areas observed. And we find that a, a short conversation really makes for a, a great secret shopping program. If you want to either phone call us or email Ellen, she's great to set up. Or if you simply go onto our website, uh, click on schedule a demo, which is on there a few different places. And if you schedule a demo, what we're going to do is send you a brand new booklet that we just finished. 10 steps to great service. This is how to put together a service plan, not just hoping for the next customer to have some good service, but this is 10 solid steps on how you work through and implement a really good service plan. So I truly appreciate your time today. Again, call us, email us. We'd love to schedule a demo and get you the 10 steps to great service. And thank you for being a part of Service with Style. Take care.